हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू टू डेज इंग्लिश क्लास इन आवर प्रीवियस क्लास वी हैव स्टार्टेड एन इंटरेस्टिंग टॉपिक द ग्रीडी फैट ओल्ड मैन बट इन दैट क्लास वी हैव कवर्ड सम पोर्सन ऑफ द टॉपिक बिफोर स्टार्टिंग अ टू डेज क्लास लेट्स हैव ए क्विक आई ऑन व्हाट वी हैव स्टडीड इन आवर प्रीवियस क्लास सो स्टूडेंट्स व्हाट वी हैव स्टडीड देर वॉज अ फैट ओल्ड मैन इज इंड इट the one day that fat old man got up from his bed at 6 am after that he brushed his teeth at 6:30 am then he took his tea at what time yes the old man took the tea at 7 am after that he took his breakfast at what time could you remember yes the old man took his breakfast at 8:30 am Could you remember what he had taken in his breakfast? Yes, the old man took two liters of milk. Then he took two mugs of tea. After that, he took three tins of biscuits, and then he took five big pieces of cake. After eating that huge amount of food, the old man looked very fat, isn't it? After that, he felt uneasy. and the old man wanted to go out then he went away from his home and on the way he met with a little thin boy so this was the gist uh, of the previous lesson in today's lesson we will cover some other portion before that i am going to ask you some questions yes you stand up please now tell me what is your name okay what is your father's name could you tell me what is your mother's name okay now one more question answer me what are your hobbies now see students i have talked with him isn't it in other word we can say i have conversed with that boy isn't it now in today's class we will read the conversation between the fat old man and the thin little boy let's see what they are conversing with each other now students I am going to read this text loudly and your work is to listen me carefully okay old man have you brushed your teeth boy no i have not old man do you have enough tea and milk to drink boy no i don't have old man do you have enough biscuit to eat boy no I don't have old man do you have enough cake to eat boy no i don't have when the old man had just finished his questions the boy asked him a question boy old man old man what makes you so fat the old man said i have taken two mugs of tea Two liters of milk. I also took three tins of biscuits and five kilograms of cakes. And if I can catch you, I will eat you up. Then the old man caught the thin little boy and ate him up. Now, students, we will find out some words. whose meaning you may not know we will discuss the topic and understand the meaning of those words let's go now students let's know some new words what is written here e n o u g h what is written enough do you know the meaning of enough no okay suppose you are taking your lunch and your mother asked you to take some more food and you do not want any more what you will say yes you will say no mother i don't need food this is enough for me or this is sufficient for me you can say also this is adequate for me so the meaning of enough is as much or as many as required okay now let's go to the next word the next word is 
finished do you know the meaning of finished no now look at this picture here is the picture of a boy here is the picture of a girl here the, what the boy is doing the boy is doing his homework but the girl has finished her homework isn't it see the girl is happy why she is happy yes because the girl has completed his task isn't it so the meaning of the word finished is an activity or task that is completed now you understood okay now let's go to the next word now students tell me what is written here yes kilogram isn't it do you know the meaning of kilogram no okay i'm giving you one example suppose your mother has asked you to bring something from the shop suppose uh, sugar and you are in the shop what you will ask the shopkeeper yes you will ask the shopkeeper please give me 2 kilograms of sugar so we are using kilograms to measure something isn't it now see this picture you must have seen these two things in the shop the shopkeeper uses both of them while measuring something isn't it this this can be used manually and this is the digital one isn't it so i think you must have understood the meaning of kilogram now let's know one another word that is cats now see this picture what the boys are doing look at this boy and look at this boy what this boy is doing yes this boy is throwing the ball what this boy is doing he is catching the ball so now we can say the meaning of catch is to hold or to capture something which has been thrown is it clear to all of you okay now students let's discuss the conversation and understand it okay so old man have you brushed your teeth boy no i have not so here the old man asked the little thin boy have you brushed your teeth so what did the boy reply no i have not then the old man asked do you have enough tea and milk to drink what did the old man asked yes the old man asked do you have enough tea and milk to drink so what did the boy replied the boy replied no i don't have okay then the old man asked do you have enough biscuit to eat the old man asked do you have enough biscuit to eat what did the boy replied yes the boy replied no i don't have again the old man asked one more question what did the old man asked yes the old man asked do you have enough cake to eat okay the old man asked do you have enough cake to eat again the boy replied no i don't have okay now students see the old man has asked four questions to the thin boy isn't it after that the boy also asked one question to the old man when the old man had just finished his questions the boy asked him a question okay what was the question the boy asked old man old man what makes you so fat the old man said i have taken two mugs of tea two liters of milk what did the old man said yes he said he has taken two mugs of tea and two liters of milk i also took 3 tins of biscuit and 5 kilograms of cakes okay and if i can catch you i will eat you up what did the old man said yes after taking all these foods also i can take some more food what if i will catch you i can eat you up then what did the old man do then the old man caught the thin little boy 
and ate in hope. Now students, let's summarize the topic. The old man and the boy had a long conversation. During their conversation, the old man asked four questions to the little boy. The old man asked, Number one, have you brushed your teeth? Number two, do you have enough tea and milk to drink? Then number three, do you have enough biscuit to eat? Then the last and fourth one is, do you have enough cake to eat? For all the questions above, the boy answered same. That is, no, I don't have. At last, the boy asked one question to the old man. That is, old man, old man, what makes you so fat? The old man said, I have taken two mugs of tea, two liters of milk, three tins of biscuits and five pieces of cake. And if I can catch you, I will eat you up. Then the old man caught the thin little boy and ate him up. So students, we have completed the text. Now let's do some comprehension questions and answers. The first question is, what is the story about? Could you answer me? What is the story about? Yes, the story is about the fat old man and the thin little boy. The story is about the story is about the fat old man and the thin little boy. Now, the second question is, when did the old man get up? Yes, answer me. When did the old man get up? Yes, the old man got up at 6 a.m. Now, I am writing the answer. The old man got up at 6 a.m. Now, coming to the third question. The third question is, how much tea did the old man take? Yes, you are right. The old man took two mugs of tea. The old man took two mugs of tea. I am writing the answer. The old man took two mugs of tea. Is that clear to you? Okay. Now, let's move to the fourth question. What is the fourth question? The fourth one is, whom did he meet on the way? Whom did he meet on the way? Could you answer me? Yes. The old man met with a thin little boy on the way. Now, I am writing the answer. The old man met with a thin little boy on 
the way so the fifth question is how many questions did the old man ask the boy yes four questions so the answer is the old man asked four questions to the boy now let's write it the old man asked four questions to the boy the sixth question is did the boy ask the old man any questions what was his question now i am writing the answer the old the boy asked one question to the old man what was his question yes old man old man what makes you so fat what makes you so fat now this is the last question what did the old man do with the boy could you remember yes the old man caught the boy and ate him up okay now i am writing the answer the old man caught the thin little boy and ate him up so now we have covered all the comprehension questions and answers is that clear to you yes now let's do some other activity now students see here are some words okay now i'm going to read them one by one what you have to do after reading i will dictate these words but you won't write them in your notebook then what you have to do you have to put a tick mark only on that word that i have read okay so now i am reading the words listen to me carefully breakfast then biscuit conversation and the next one is enough questions after that cats greedy okay so now i will read one word what you have to do you will put a tick mark over that word now enough where it has been written yes it is written here now put a tick mark on cats where it is written yes here cats is written now put a tick mark on conversation conversation find it where it is written yes this one is conversation okay now put a mark on 
questions yes questions now put a mark on breakfast where it is written yes here okay now greedy yes it is written here now where it is written biscuit the last one yes so we have completed this task now let's do another exercise what listen to me carefully i am going to read a paragraph you just listen to me then what you have to do now see here is another paragraph but here some words are missing what you have to do you have to fill it up with the words that is appropriate for it okay then he went out for a walk he walked walked and walked till he met a little thin boy he had a long conversation with the boy okay now you don't see this paragraph you have to write this by yourself then he went dash for a dash yes write it then he went dash for a dash okay then he went out for a what work he worked worked and dash till he dash a little thin dash yes fill it up think it yes he worked worked and worked and worked till he dash met a little thin boy yes you were right then he had a dash conversation dash the boy fill it up he had a dash conversation yes you were right he had a long conversation dash the boy with the boy okay now students listen to me i am reading it again then he went out for a walk he walked walked and walked till he met a little thin boy he had a long conversation with the boy with this we have completed this exercise also so students what we have learned from today's class we learned the conversation between the fat old man and the little thin boy so this much is for today bye bye